Ahoy mateys and welcome to Shipwrecks. The Derbyshire was a bulk carrier. Today she has the notoriety of being the largest British ship to have ever been lost at sea at twice the size of the Titanic. The MB Derbyshire was considered almost new at four years old. She was well maintained and manned with a capable and competent British crew at the helm. The vessel was originally built in 1976 and was considered one of the largest and most advanced ships of its time. It was designed to withstand extreme weather conditions, however, on that fateful day of September 9, 1980, the Derbyshire encountered a typhoon off the coast of Japan in the South China Seas. The weather pattern was much stronger and more violent than the ship's design was built to withstand. The voyage was supposed to be routine, but it turned into a tragic tale that shocked the world. If any vessel should have been able to ride out that typhoon, it should have been the massive Derbyshire. Yet she succumbed to the rough seas and vanished overnight without having time to put out a distress message. The sinking of the MV Derbyshire was one of the deadliest maritime disasters in history, and it sent shockwaves throughout the shipping industry. Unbelievably, it took 20 years before the reasons for the sinking were finally known. MV Derbyshire was given three conflicting weather reports predicting different paths for the storm, so the ship altered course to avoid all three. Despite the captain's efforts, the ship was hit by several massive waves and it eventually sank, taking all 44 souls to the bottom of the ocean floor some four kilometers down. <laughs>